Hey, how's it going? This is Jesse with New View Painting. Uh, today we're going to be prepping this door for getting it ready to do uh, some paint work on it. And we're going to be using a uh, 220 grit sanding sponge and after that a uh, tack cloth to get all of the dust and debris off of it. The reason we want to do this is basically it has a bit of a shine to it. Um, we want to make sure that we get all of the imperfections out and kind of scuff this up so that when we apply our primer, we're going to be using Smart Prime. It's a Zinzer product, really good for priming trim, cabinets, and uh, just I really like this product because it seems to work better than um, a lot of other products that we've tried. So we've kind of just adopted this and that's kind of what we like to use. So after we uh, prime it, we want to let the primer set up on it, and then we're going to be applying uh, Aqua Elkid from Hall & Lindsay. This is a satin finish. It's a really good trim enamel, and uh, the color today is going to be sugar dust. So first you're going to want to take your sanding sponge and basically just start scuffing up that surface. You don't have to go crazy, but you definitely want to scuff it up and try to get some of that sheen off of it. Basically now you just want to take your tack cloth after you got it all sanded, do a quick run through on it, get any debris off there. Really making sure that that surface is clean. So, and the main reason we do this is this is going to give it a better bite. So when we apply that Smart Prime, it's going to stick better to this surface after we lightly sand it and use the tack cloth to get the debris off. Now before we sanded this door, we had actually cleaned it, so we got any gunk off, any dirt that may have been on there before, just to make the sanding go a little bit easier. Alright, so we got the door sanded, and we used a tack cloth to get all the debris off. Uh, next video is going to be... I was putting some primer on and then after that applying some paint and eventually we'll have a finished product.